Hello and welcome back to Fallout New Vegas on the Steam Deck. Today we are going to find the Brotherhood of Steel. Let me move my mic a little bit so my arm doesn't bump into it while we're playing. Alright, so let me take a look here. We're at Gene Skydiving thingy. And it is here. Looks like we got a road right here that partially leads out to it. So let's head that way. Alright, there is some enemies over there. Are those Cazadors? Of course they're Cazadors. Why wouldn't they be? Well, let's go ahead and head out. What about it? What we got up there? We got a couple figures. I can't tell yet if they're friendly or not. Nope, they are not friendly. Uh oh. Calm down, Veronica. We'll sneak up on. Never mind, we won't sneak up on them. Are they just powder gangers? Whatever, powder gangers. I literally don't care. Even though I missed the other shots. Bang! Just bang and they're dead. Powder ganger infamy gained. Of course. Well, that guy's dead. Alright. Let's take their crap. Ooh, they have stim, stim packs. That's cool. Oh, that guy didn't. Crimson Caravan Guard leather armor. Let's see what leather armor is like. Um, so what we have has DT of 12. That has a DT of 5. Never mind. I no longer care. Ooh, but there's a bed here. Let's loot this place first. Ooh, scrap metal. Cool. How much scrap metal do we have? 17. Let's sleep for about six hours. It's an okay amount of sleep. And we'll heal up, right? Yep. Alright, anyways. How far away are we from this? Looks like right over here is where that path goes off to the side. Yep, right here. So I guess we'll have to stick to this road, if you'd even call it a road, and more powder gangers. There went one. And there went two. Easy peasy. Might as well take this stuff. We can sell all of it later. Ooh, is that the is that that a uh, prison that they broke away from? That's cool. Not where we're going, but hold on, what's up there? Just more powder gangers. That makes sense! If they broke out of this prison right here, then it would make sense that there's a bunch of them just laying around here. Throwing dynamite! Are we joking? Where'd they go? No, 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 no. Where'd they go? Did they blow themselves up? Is that what happened? They were right over here. Fine, fine, I'll be careful. Literally blew themselves up. Let's try to be careful. Vats isn't picking up any other mines, so we might be okay. Oh. 
Sheesh. How am I? Do I still have limb damage? No, we're fine. No, we're fine. Three hours of sleep and my li your and limbs are fine. Yeah, they blew themselves up. Come on, guys. Come on. Whoops. Well, let's keep heading towards our objective. We really need a sniper rifle. Maybe we can look for a sniper rifle after we're done with uh, the Brotherhood. I don't remember how long the quest line is with them in this game. Trespassers, trespassers, something. Beware, trespasser, beware. Okay, is this is this Hidden Valley? I don't think it is. No, we're not quite there yet. Danger. Oh, it is Hidden Valley. All right. Well, we're here at Hidden Valley. There's a fan here. I see something moving over there. Scorpions, maybe? Looks like uh -oh. scorpions. It's just scorpions. We should, uh, if they're anything like the ones from before, we should be okay. Alright, the little ones are, you know, one hit. Yeah. So the little ones should be perfectly okay. Only thing we'd have to worry about is maybe bigger ones. Not seeing anything else so far. I think we're in the clear. Here we go. This is the bunker. Ban the bomb. You suck! Steve was here. Fight apathy, or don't. All war is the bomb. Peace, peace. Give peace a chance. Love. Okay, that's neat. Well, let's go ahead and save. So we just go in? I guess so. I don't think we have a get a warm welcome here. The Brotherhood in this game are kind of hiding. Hold on, I've got this. I'd like a large atomic shake and a double Brahmin burger. And easy on the agave sauce this time. A double Brahmin burger? I gave you a password, Veronica. It's for your safety. I know where you live, Ramos. Open up. <sighs> for Pete's sake. Opening up. Welcome back, Veronica. He sounds like he likes her about as much as um, the Diamond City guard likes Piper. You remember that when you would go up and Piper basically had to twist his uh, twist his leg to get him to let her in what's up nothing you just weren't going in I guess you're following my lead open door to hidden valley bunker l1 Listen up. 
I'm in charge of security around here. And I can't say I'm too happy about having an outsider waltzing around. But since you came in with Veronica, I'm inclined to cut you a little slack. Just behave yourself, and we won't have any problems, okay? Oh, and the Elder's going to want to talk to you. He's on the second level. Just take a right once you get down there. My office is right here in case you need anything. Just ask for Ramos. All right. Looks like we're going to need our flashlight in this area. I also want to, like, raise brightness just a little bit. Let's go to display. How's that look? That looks pretty Looking good. Looking sharp, Ramos. Behave yourself this time, Veronica. Actually, that looks much better. Don't know how it'll look outside, but the indoor areas certainly look better like this. Let's see what it looks like without the full flashlight on. That looks pretty decent. Oh, and we got our nice little Brotherhood of Steel emblem right here. I actually have a Brotherhood of Steel fan. Or, I'm not fan. Flag. That's actually, uh, that's, uh, hanging up in my office room. I've had it probably for a couple years now. Well, there's nothing really to do in here, so I guess we should just go where we're supposed to be going. They'll probably think I look a little weird walking in with this uh, power armor helmet on. Probably like, where'd you get that? Ooh, they got turrets. Look at this place. This place is cool. I always lo have loved the Brotherhood of Steel's aesthetic. It's real cool. Um, I guess we're supposed to go this way. Do you have anything to say? After this, I have some weapons to repair. Okay. Well, you, uh, you have fun doing your thing, I guess. Hmm. Through here? Level two. Veronica. Seems the destruction of the monorail didn't slow the NCR down much. How many troops do they have? Oh, hello, Initiate. This guy looks important. As much as I'm sick of Taggart's VR sims, I have to admit, we wouldn't be combat ready without them. Yeah? Okay. Just Brotherhood Scribe? Seems the destruction of the monorail didn't slow the NCR down much. How many troops do they have? Oh, that's the same thing the last one said. Don't work too hard there, Ibsen. Yes, yes. Terminals? The bunker takes a little getting used to, doesn't it? Maybe it's this way. Because this is one of the side things that I always tried to do whenever I would play this game. Just because I like the Brotherhood of Steel. Wait a minute, is this a vault? I know the aesthetics of the doors don't really look like vault doors, but this looks like an overseer's office. I thought he wanted to talk to me. Hello, Veronica. How goes your... Veronica? Did something screw up? What's this? Ooh, is this where all the factions are? Like, that's probably the NCR right there. Um... Children of Adam, maybe? With it being a rocket? Or maybe that's talking about the ghouls? That's... I think that's Helios 1. Let's try this again. It won't let me talk to him. Hello, Veronica. How goes your mission? We'll know in a second. I wanted to talk to you. Veronica, tell me this isn't about... Yes, goddammit, it is. But you're gonna hear me out this time. We've been through this. The things I've seen now, other groups succeeding where we fail, it's not too late for us. We've outlasted the end of the world. We'll outlast these upstarts. Waiting in a hole for everyone else to die. If we must. This is a dead end for us. I see no evidence of that. 
Nor do I see anyone out there with a solution to our problems. How could you? You're too scared to look. Let's go. We're wasting our time. Um. Okay. I'd slap him around, but he stood at my parents' wedding. Plus, he used to make excuses to get me out of my punishment when I'd slept through head scribe Taggart's lectures. Figure I owe him for that. <sighs> he means well. Well? What do we do now? I'm not giving up. He wants evidence, but he'll never go looking for it. He's scared I'm right. He'll never listen unless I hold the proof right in front of his face. All right. You think he'll listen at all? He's a stubborn old man, but when it comes down to it, he's got our best interests at heart. If he sees some indisputable sign we're on the wrong course, he won't ignore it. All righty. So what exactly is it that you're trying to accomplish here, Veronica? That's my question to the Elder. All these years, the Brotherhood has collected weapons technology. And for what? To keep it out of people's hands? That clearly hasn't worked. To defend ourselves? We can't compete with the NCR's numbers or the Legion's. We're fighting a war for a lost cause. If we're going to survive, we have to find a role in society, attract new members. And how would you propose to do that? Look at the followers of the apocalypse. They use their expertise to improve people's lives. They train them to be self-sufficient. That expertise cultivates respect and gratitude, spreads their ideals, draws talent to their cause, they make friends like we make enemies. But they don't know a fraction of what we know. If we took on their role, we could stand up to anyone. We wouldn't have to hide. Interesting. Now I understand why you have to do all of this stuff before Veronica takes you to the bunker. Because we went we went and talked to the followers, I think, in that, uh, in that fort in Freeside. So I'm assuming she's like pulling up you know, things that she's actually noticed as she's been traveling with the player character, with the courier. That actually makes sense in a story perspective, outside of, you know, just a gameplay perspective of, oh, you gotta go through all these hoops to be able to get into the Brotherhood of Steel. Well, what can we bring to him that, that changes his mind? I don't know. I don't know. We need something that shows the Brotherhood will fail or that it can do better a different way. The only thing that gets his attention is technology. Huh. Maybe Father Elijah had the right idea. Father Elijah? Our elder before McNamara. He had a nose for recovering lost technology. He'd send scribes out into the desert chasing whatever leads he found. There were a few he only trusted me with. I can think of at least one that'd prove my point, if it still exists. There's a comm terminal not too far from here I'd use to access messages from him. If we go there, I can pull up his research on it. Sure. Let's I'm go. With you. Being around here isn't the same anymore. Sure. Uh, let's go ahead and talk to the scribes, too. What is this? Veronica brings an outsider into our home, then has a private audience with the Elder? The two of you may have the Elder fooled, but we know better. Veronica has always twisted the Founder's principles to her own ends. We will not stand idly by and allow her to corrupt our Elder's thinking. Okay. Um... Sorry about that. Just because I love them doesn't mean some of them aren't assholes. Is that it? Okay. Uh, I'm assuming that'll come up later. Even though the patrols no longer go out. We've got a backlog of devices that require investigation. Let's save. I want to take a look at the the, the stuff that they have he has on his person. Ah, eh, never mind. It won't actually let me see the ro the scribe robes. I know we're supposed to leave. Evening. Evening. Hi, guys. Hmm? Oh, you must be the outsider everyone's buzzing about. Pleased to meet you. I'm Lorenzo, senior knight and general handyman around here. Well, I guess I can't do with anything. Maybe we can do stuff with them after we do Veronica's thing. 
All right. Well, I guess I guess we just gotta leave. Unless more story stuff will happen later. You're being watched, so don't get any ideas. I'm fine. Calm down, guys. I'm not gonna do anything. You want to watch me? You go right ahead. Are these beds? Is this supposed to be a bed? Interesting. Well, all right then. I guess we just need to follow the marker to the exit. Here we go. I was hoping to be able to do more here right now, but, uh, you know, if we gotta go, we gotta go. Now, since we're leaving, before we continue Veronica's quest, I want to see... I want to see if there's a there's a special sniper rifle in this game, and I want to see if we can get it yet. Hmm. Let's go out, and then we'll look to see if we can realistically go to this place. Because I would like to get an actual sniper rifle. Whoa! What's with the sandstorm, guys? Anyways. All right, let's see if there's any place on here that we recognize. Not really. We'll have to look at... Oh, here we go. It's way down here. Um, that looks like the right sort of area. Um, so it's about right here. Oof, that's gonna be a hike no matter how you... No matter how you shake it. Alright. We'll try. Hopefully it won't take too terribly long. Right, this place that got raised by the Legion. Well, let's go. We're gonna go on a hike, and then we'll uh, we'll finish Veronica's thing. We're not on a timetable with her, anyways, so I think it's fine. Oh boy, I don't know if we'll be able to get it here, but at le at the very least, we'll uh, try to get over to the area and discover its location. Because it's in a sniper's nest that the NCR uses. Alright. What do we got? Ooh. Never mind. Veronica's on top of things. Anyways. That was incredibly rude. What's around here? Who set that mine there? Was it you? Oh, a viper... A viper member? That's cool. You don't have a head anymore. Bottle cap. DT of one. Garbage. 
literal garbage. All right, well, let's go ahead and use a uh, doctor's bag to get rid of that limb problem. Whoa! Did you see that frame drop? Wow! I didn't do it that time. Well, I guess we're safe now. Ronnie, you still with me? There she is. Well, let's go and get this sniper rifle, and then we'll continue on doing our Brotherhood of Steel stuff. What was that noise? Uh-oh. Yeah, okay. Good job, Veronica. Excellent work. What's going on over here? Are all of the enemies just spawning by Veronica all the way back here? There we go. Got him! I'll we'll wait for the body to just roll its way down to us. Okay, Veronica, I guess it's not that safe here, is it? This ambient music is creepy. Alright. The road goes to the right up here, so we'll just stay on the road here. For as long as we can. Can we enjoy the ambience of the nighttime now? Put our guns away and just enjoy nature or what's left of it in post apocalyptic America? I see something down there. Is that Nellis Air Force Base, maybe? Because I know there's an Air Force Base that we come across in the game. World map. How far are we? We're not that far. Jeez. Alright. Let's just keep going down this path. We've got quite the hike left for us. Kind of curious about this building over here. Farmstead. Okay. Yeah, all this is probably empty because it says it was raided. First aid box isn't empty. Leather armor. Um. I didn't do it.
Ooh, super stim packs. Awesome. Well, anyways. Ah, there's somebody. Oh, crap. No, this is a Viper Gunslinger. They shouldn't be throwing dynamite at us. Well, I got one of them. Punch him. You're not gonna punch him? All right, I'll shoot their head off then. Or not. What is happening right now? Jeez, there's a bunch of them. There we go, now there's two less. Don't worry, I got this, Veronica. I think that was all of them. Jeez, look at all this meat hanging around here. Good. All right, we're at 200 out of 235 for this. Let's not pick up anything else. Let's just keep uh, moving towards where we need to go. Actually, hold on. This is an abandoned building, right? Let's see if there was a bed. Let's see if there was a uh, a bed in here. Doesn't look like it. We got limb problems too. That's great. I mean, if it's anything like Fallout 76, limb limb damage will just he heal naturally as we go. That was quite the interesting thing that, you know, went from, I'm curious about this building to why are there so many vipers here? I guess it was supposed to be a trap. I see the NCR's flag here, so maybe this is a friendly place. Hang on there, Traveler. You'll want to steer clear of this place. The whole town's irradiated to high hell. All right, then why are you here? I was stationed at Camp Searchlight before the incident. I've since taken it upon myself to keep travelers away from the area. All right, what happened? Some legionaries snuck into the camp and set off some kind of radiation bomb. I don't know where they got it, but it was damn effective. Killed almost everyone and turned the rest into ghouls. How did you survive? I was out on patrol at the time, so I wasn't in the camp when it happened. There were a few others with me after it happened, including some of my superiors. Between radiation poisoning and attacks by the Legion, they all died out. That sucks. How'd the Legion get in? I don't know, unfortunately. There may be clues somewhere inside the camp, but I'm not about to run in there to find out. All right. Stay safe. Yeah, I will. All right, camp searchlight. We got to be careful here, I guess. I think we've got a few rad X, so we should be, we should be okay. Got a bed here? Are we joking? 
I'm good with the NCR. Well, we got to pass through here to get to the sniper's nest. All right. As long as we got Radax in, we should be okay. Let's just pass through this area. Looks like there are legionaries in here. I do like that there's a kind of like a yellow tint to the, the air here because it's radiated. That's pretty cool. Whoa, the game's getting real, I don't know. Jittery in this area? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I, I guess Veronica found someone to punch in the face. That Good for you, Veronica. More radiation signs. Well, hopefully it's not radiated all the way to the sniper nest. Got something up here. What we got up here? Oh, ghouls. You know, that makes sense. This is a radiated area. Whoa, bam! And we, we gained karma again for killing a ghoul. Interesting. Nothing I care about on your person. What do we have down here? That's an interesting looking place. So if there are legionaries wandering around that town that they blew up a radiation bomb in, I wonder if they've e they've uh, got some anti-radiation stuff. Probably stocked up on Radex. I mean, there are th there are you know they're they're an organized group. How close are we? But anyways, yeah, they're an organized group, so they, they probably have supplies available. Oh, we should be right by the sniper's nest right now. I didn't realize we were already here. I guess I just got too into uh, our little trek. It's supposed to be up here somewhere, right? Oh, I'm crippled. Sorry. Let me use a uh, stim pack real quick. Hmm. Let me take a look at my map. So from Camp Searchlight. We should have already passed it. Turn around. I feel like this area right here is where it should be. Oh, there, there we go. I bet it's that building right there. Yeah, there we go. You need a pick lock skill of 100 to pick this lock. 308 rounds are is nice. So... Hmm. 
couple more levels and I'll be able to get this. Unless we have items to increase lockpicking. Nope. All right. Well, that sucks. That just means that our next two levels are going to be dedicated pretty much solely to lockpicking. Let's continue Veronica's quest. And once we reach... Anyways, once we reach a couple more levels, I guess. Oh, hold on. We're at, we're at Lady Gibson's house. She's a merchant. So, you're back. Now, where did we leave off? I have stuff for you. Like that, 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 that. This, this. All this. Yeah, all that. What else? All this ammo I'm never going to use. Anything else? You can have all this NCR funds too. Do you have anything cool for me? Another satisfied customer. Yep, I just wanted to offload my stuff. Alright. Veronica, let's head out. If we can even head out this way. I don't think we can. No, we can't. We'll have to go out and around. Alright. Well, on the bright side, we don't have to hike over to the sniper's nest anymore. Once we get lockpicking up to 100... We'll be able to get in there and get that sniper rifle. Because, I mean, the rifle that we've got is working out really well. But, like, um... What's our thing at? Battle rifle's damage of 34. I think the sniper rifle that is in that box is a damage of, like, 45, give or take. Based on what I saw online. Gibson Shack? Sure. Is this Lady Gibson stuff? Uh, looks like all this stuff we can take if we want. We have an admin password for this? Oh! I think this is where we were supposed to go. Oops. Didn't even realize. Let's see what we've got here. Okay, yeah, this is the one I was thinking of. The pulse gun. Although, maybe the rangefinder could work too. And it looks like the NCR was onto some miracle farming technology. Yeah, I wouldn't put much stock in that farming technology. If it's what we if it's what they sent us to look at. Alright, alright. What's a pulse gun? Electromagnetic weapon from before the Great War. Experimental. It never saw mass production. But they were building it as a countermeasure to power armor, which they feared the Chinese were developing. Supposedly a prototype was being housed at Nellis. Imagine what it could do to the Brotherhood. We'd be on equal footing with any idiot with a gun. Alright. Tell me about the rangefinder. It's a targeting device for some kind of doomsday weapon based at Helios-1. It was lost sometime after the war. We held Helios-1 for a time. Lost a lot of people defending it. Too many. All for this weapon they never got working. 
If it turns out to be a dud, you'd show how flawed our goals have been. Father Elijah said he thinks a scavenger might have sold it on the strip. Farming tech? Hmm, more or less. Supposedly, it's a vegetation enhancer. NCR has a science branch headquartered at McCarran Airport. Guess they found something. Guess somebody wasn't very good at keeping secrets either. We'd never pursue it because it's not a weapon, but self-sufficiency is fundamental to us. If it works, they'd see the value of an alternate course. All right, um, well, I guess we can go look for this pulse gun. Yeah, maybe they'll think twice about engaging the NCR if they know one of those could be floating around. The notes say to look around Nellis Air Force Base. All right, let's talk about the rangefinder. They defended Helios like it was their last stand. Didn't even know if there was anything worth defending. How could there be, with all we lost? Even if it did work, it'd be under NCR control now. There's a pawn shop in Outer Vegas we could check. All right, and farm tech. Okay, what better? Maybe the best place to start is to see what we can find out directly from the NCR. Let's go find it. Have we been to Vault 22? Let's see where are these markers are. There's Vault 22, which we have been to. Oh, right. That's the Vegetation Vault. Sure, let's go. Some of this stuff I don't know if we'll be able to uh, do right now. Because we technically haven't gone onto the strip yet. All right, let's take a look in here. I wonder if Victor's still in here <laughs> when Victor randomly showed up. You know, I was going to look up online if anybody else had had that happen, and I never did. New Vegas, Victor in Vault 22. Nope, I don't see anything. Maybe it was just random chance of him just showing up literally anywhere. Alright, let's go into oxygen recycling. Oh, thankfully, we've already cleared this place out. Common areas, maybe? Food production. Just following my marker. Hmm. All right. Local map. Pass control. All right, well, let's go to pest control. Local map. Right there. So maybe whatever it is, is on this floor. Can I? No, I cannot. I was hoping I could get over there that way, but no such luck. Looks like all the enemies in here didn't respawn, so that's good for us. So we don't have to deal with them right now. Is it from this terminal? No. It's down this way a little farther.
Is it in one of these filing cabinets? Local map. Sorry, Veronica. I'm trying to trying to find the right way to go here. We passed it. These filing cabinets are empty, so it's definitely not in there. Recover the experimental data from Vault 22. I might, we might not be able to do this anymore. So we'll go back and talk. Yeah, I don't think we can do that. Let's take a look. can't complete the Vault 22 quest if you've already done the Camp McCarran stuff. So we cannot do this now. Hmm. Okay. Alright. Well, this is a dud, Veronica. We're gonna have to leave. What's up? Alright. Pulse gun. Yeah. Maybe they'll think... The notes say to look around. All right, let's go to Nellis Air Force Base then. This is going to open up a lot of options for us for stuff we can do. Because there's a lot of stuff you can do at Nellis. Well, this sucks that we couldn't do this. All right. Where's Nellis Air Force Base at? That's a that that's a hike. Uh, what about the other thing? What's up? Rangefinder. They defended. All right. Well, this isn't going super well for us, but to be perfectly honest, I think they expected you to already go into Vegas and do a bunch of main story stuff before you dive into all of the different factions. But we'll see if we can get at least one of these. Ooh, is this a playground here? That's neat. Looks like a little UFO. How close are we? Pretty close. To one of these markers. side all right supposedly one of our places is right inside this door
Ah, the pawn shop. Here we go. Let's go to the pawn shop and see what we can find out. Let's go ahead and turn that off. If you're down on your luck and need some caps, I buy just about anything. Of course, I've also got plenty of things for sale, too. I'm looking for a rangefinder somebody might have sold to you a while back. Antique rangefinder? I'm trying to think of something that'd be more worthless. Maybe an antique horoscope. I'll tell you something. Good luck finding that thing. But if you do find it, don't waste your time trying to sell it to me. Alright. Of course. Well, let's see what he does have for sale. Got scrap metal? Nope. Ammo, you got 306s? Nope, you don't. Alright. Well, that's not gonna work out, I guess. Here to do business? Have you been in Westside long? My grandfather opened up this shop. Alright. Is that it? What's up? Alright. Well, I guess this, uh, this place is a dud. Where's the exit to this place? There it is. World map. Where's the other place? Down there? Alright. Well, let's go to the other place, see if we can find it there. Wild Goose Chase, right? So I guess the point of this is just like Veronica saying, hey, look at this technology and use it as a, I guess as a reason to justify the Brotherhood being on the wrong path. How close are we? Mm -hmm. Turn to your left. Oh, maybe we have to go up here to get inside New Vegas to then take a pathway to get here. Wait a minute, where are we going with this? Is this is this the? I said it was a vault, right? Yeah, there's a vault on the strip of New Vegas. Let's just go here. And then we'll just go... F then we'll just go from there. Yep, we're gonna have to go this way. Well, I guess we're gonna... Submit to a credit check, or present your passport before proceeding to the gate. Um... Credit check? Admission to the strip requires an official passport, or proof that you're carrying the required minimum balance. These policies prevent less reputable persons from entering, and ensure a good time will be had by all who enter the strip. Okay. Thank you, sir. You may proceed. You didn't take that money, did you? No, I guess you just have to... ...have to have at least that much money to be able to go into the New Vegas Strip. Alright, now let's see if we get frame drops here. Because when we did the, our initial Steam Deck tests, yep, here's the strip, and there's those frame drops that I knew of. Alright. Alright. 
But yeah, this is the Vegas Strip. Why do they call it a monorail? It's a train. So yeah, here's the Lucky 38 Casino, which is where the main story will continue. And we can continue onward. There's Vault 21, which I think is where we have to go. There's the Ultra Lux. There's, uh, yeah, there's side quests in all of these places. It's crazy. But for right now, let's focus on the Brotherhood, and then we'll come back here, and then we'll do the main story. There we go. Vault 21 gift shop is where we need to go. Hi, I'm Sarah, Sarah Weintraub. Welcome to the finest vault hotel in the whole world. Alright. What kind of things do you sell in the gift shop? I have all sorts of things. Vault souvenirs, vault wares. I'm looking for an antique rangefinder someone might have sold you. Wow, I wish I had more of them. All this interest to be my biggest seller. I sold it to a man not too long ago. Real twitchy, nervous sort of guy. Kind of seemed like he was wigging out about something. Had a funny collar on. I wanted to ask him about it, but I figured maybe I'd regret asking. What kind of collar? Well, it was metal and kind of thick. At first I thought he'd come from Gamora, but they're more into leather there. Didn't look comfortable. Did you happen to find out where he's from? Wait a minute. Oh no, I think he's he was from Caesar's Legion. No, but I know where he was going. He asked me if I knew of any place where he could hide out for a while. Wanted somewhere with concrete walls. But I guess he spent all his money on the rangefinder because he said it had to be somewhere free to stay. What did you tell him? I said I didn't know about anything like that around here, but if he wanted to live for free, a lot of people do that in Freeside. I know there's a concrete building there across from Mick and Ralph's. No ceiling, but I think it still counts. Went up there one time to try and, you know, meet my neighbors in the biz. But, you know, I don't think they took me very seriously. All right, what do you look like? Oh, he was pretty average, I'd say. Average height, average age, dark hair, beard of some kind. All right, let's see what you have for sale. Let's see what she has for sale first, just to, just so we can see. Vault 21 jumpsuit. Sunset Sarsaparilla. All right. I don't like the sound of this. Hope that color isn't what I think it is. What did you do, Elisha? Yep. Veronica and I are on the same wavelength. I think the Legion uses slave collars. So let's... Let's go to Freeside and we'll take a look at this. Yeah, we'll have to go in through here. Oh, I think this is the same gate we did the previous one that was right next to. Never mind. It wasn't. Oh, yeah, it is. Here is Mick and, Mick and Ralph's right here. Is this our buddy? Hey, Dixon. Hello there. Hey, you're the one who's been going around. Oh, cool. Free money again. Ooh, 34. Sweet. All right, let's see if we can find this guy. Maybe he's up on the second level here. Hmm. Ask around to see what became of the rangefinder, alright. Let's ask Disc Dixon, see if he knows anything. Looking for a fix, man? Looks like I can't ask Dixon. There's someone over here we can talk to. Hey, bud. Huh? Alright. These tin caps are yours if you point me to anyone you've seen with a weird old gun. Kids. Run five. 
All right. Recover the rangefinder. Evening. Evening? Who said that? I don't see anybody here. You're up here. Wake up, Max! Reach for the sky, mister. Can I buy that gun from you? This is the best gun in the whole... All right, it's worth 1000 to me. You mean it? I bet me and Stacy can get something real cool. Cool. Wow. Good thing the safety was on. Yep. Good thing the safety was on. Find a way to enable the rangefinder at Helios 1. All right. This is going to be a uh bit of a doozy of a thing then where's Helios one at right there let's go back to Gibson scrapyard we did a uh, part with a lot of caps for that but it's fine I think that's Helios one right there Sorry, I had to hiccup there for a second. So, Helios won. The Brotherhood fought the NCR for it and lost. That's about all I know. This is a restricted area. State your business. I'm with the NCR. Shut up. Your being here is a start, soldier. We aren't exactly overflowing with troopers here. But if you really want to help us, talk to the idiot with sunglasses in the back of the plant building. He's been trying to get this place running for months and hasn't made any forward progress. All right. Well, we're not doing that. We are still working on... Our stuff. Hey, guys. You know, it just makes me wonder if we're going to have to help the NCR reactivate this stupid place. Before we'll be able to get the rangefinder working. Who the hell are you? Settle down. I'm not here to replace anybody. Damn right you're not. What job do you have here? What else? I'm in charge. I'm in this charge. This whole operation depends on me. No fantastic, no power. Got the whole NCR suckling my teats. And it feels so good. Yeah, okay. What exactly do you do? Fuck, man. Everything. I push buttons, I turn dials. Like one time I imagined they were a code to get into a vault full of naked women. Man, how cool would that be? So you have no idea what you're doing? No, man. I know exactly what I'm doing. Over there controls power in this building. That station has readouts on the computer network. That big knob there makes a crazy noise. Okay. Well, hey man. looks like I can't interact with this stuff. Hello. Hello. 
Hi. Yo. All right. Why are you worried about being replaced? Worried? Do I look worried to you? How'd you get this job? It was easy, man. They were going door to door asking if anyone knew any scientists. They so you lied. What are you trying to accomplish? What? Turning on power. How would someone retarget the mirrors? There's these two terminals outside. They control the mirrors. You'd have to get them to talk to the mainframe up in the tower. Hey, you're not. I am now. Well, hey, if you find yourself up at the mainframe, do yourself a favor and make sure you send the power to the right place. It needs to go to the strip and McCarran. Why? Because I get paid. Whatever. Excuse me. Alright. We're still on I Can Make You Care. I guess we got a fix this place before we can do anything with the rangefinder. I guess that makes sense. If the weapon is here at Helios 1... Hmm. Alright, well, I guess we're doing this now. So I'm assuming it uses solar energy to power this weapon. Whatever. Reset mainframe connection. All right. That was very rude. Connect to the Helios 1 mainframe from the Eastern Reflector Control Terminal. So I'm assuming that's over here somewhere. While we injure ourselves. Not allowed to use these beds, of course. Because why would we be able to do that? when we're members of the NCR, practically. What's over here? I see red blips. It kind of sounds like wild dogs. Is there- oh, we walked right by the gate. I'm dumb. Wait, what? Why would NCR guard dogs be hostile? Whatever. Don't mind me, dogs. Oh, I don't have the science skill to do this. Crap. Um, how much do I need in science? A lot. Almost 20. Oof. 
Yeah, I'm not going to be able to do this yet. Sorry, guard dog. I hope this doesn't ruin my reputation with the NCR. Dog meat, dog hide. Science skills 75 is required to hack the terminal. This sucks. Hmm. Archimedes two charge, that's the thing we found. Wow, Mr. House is looking. Yeah, the notes say to look around Nellis Air. Hmm, yeah. All right, we're kind of at a standstill here. Because I just don't have enough points to do these quests. So I say, we come up here to the strip, what we're going to do is we're going to put the, the Brotherhood of Seal to the side for now. And next time, we're going to do some main story stuff, at least until we can level up enough to get our points high enough to actually do this stuff. So we will probably head in and see Mr. House next time on Fallout New Vegas on the Steam Deck.